Hello champions, now we're going to do the blitz on hell mode and this time we're going to be using the fiend because the fiend gives you a bonus of 750 points. I don't have either of the superstar that gives you the 900 bonus, but for 750 you can use either the fiend or Drew McIntyre. Obviously fiend is better and mine is leveled, so he's the one we're going to go with. Mine currently maxed out at five star bronze that is level 210 moves we'll be using are the black running cross body block along with both purples and trainers are zombie set uh, not zombie shield set and a zombie brock and I have coach nikki bella and ogan nwo ogan that is uh, Nikki for the sub damage and Ogan for the MP. So let's do this. I don't expect much resistance. Right, so put on those. Already out of health. There's not really any point to add the bleed gems, but overkill's fun. And it's or Number two, Randy Savage. Same thing, get the protect gems out. and refill the purple back and the reason I say refill the purple while I actually hit the black it's because I got the skill plate get that gives me purple when I get black Definitely some better characters that this skill, skill plate can be used on where it's more effective. But this prevent me from many issues I've had with the Fiend during uh, Showdown and uh, during Feud where I would just not get any purple anywhere and, and would be stuck able to do nothing. Kill plate is basically my backup. If I can get purple, well, if I can get black, I'm still good. And uh, I've had the fiend be uh, much, much more effective for me in all those game modes since. Normally I would do the gem, the protect gems again plus the bleed again and then the submission, but he's out of health, so there's no point going through three animations when one's gonna do it. Okay, take her now. Thank gems. Lead. 
since I do have the skill plate, I always like to go for black more than go for purple. In this case, anyway, I didn't have any purple, but when I have both, I like to go for black first because that way I can get my protect gems back as well as the purple that I need. Again, just to sort of finish this. And since I get the Protect Gem out on the first turn, I don't get any damage. Okay, match number five versus Daniel Bryan. Gems. Bleed. And let's get the black back. And the purple. Got one damage. Another round of Protect Gems. He does have a little health this time. Add another stack of Bleed. And now the Submission with two Bleeds on. And this shouldn't take long. And he's out. Still only lost one out. Attack. Bleed. And I mean, each of those protect are 2,000 each, so. And there's 36 of them. Still only did one damage. Another round protects. Almost the entire board. Minus seven. Another round of bleed. And submission to end this. Basically two turns of submission is enough with the two stacks of bleed. And we're gonna finish the blitz having lost one elt. Which is still considered 100% with only one elt. <laughs> All right, well, that is it, guys. Thanks for watching. If you're not already a sub, make sure to do so to be kept aware when I post new stuff. Have any questions, ask them. And if you like the video, leave a like and share. See you guys. Gia. Ciao.